Hello everybody, Jester here, and welcome back to Fallout 4, where when we last left off, we just got back from the glowing sea, where we spoke to Virgil, who is a super mutant and was a scientist for the Institute, and he told us how we get into the Institute. We have got to find a Courser, Nothing to see here. Uh, who is essentially a, an overpowered synth. And we've got to get the chip from his head, the Courser chip, which will give us the, uh, essentially the technology we need in order to teleport into the Institute, which is the only way in and out of said Institute. But the Coursers sound very dangerous, so for the time being we're going to put that to one side and we want to focus on more important things, such as saving the commonwealth from criminals as the silver shroud <laughs> yeah we're going to head back to good neighbor and see if kent has any more tasks for us for some reason my frame rate is whoa this is not the right time to have bad frame rate why on earth can i not i cannot switch to any other body part what the hell is going on okay yeah, my frame rate is doing terrible right now. I've got no idea why. Okay, let's uh, go through your head now. Critical. Okay, wait, what did I just... Okay, I don't have enough action points for this. What's it? Oh, Dark Brother. Did I just get quest from here. No. It was just me discovering somewhere. Right. Uh, do... I will take on... A... Sure, I'll take the hound meat as well. Running low on ammo again, which I do not like. I do not, I do not like running low on ammo. Uh, should we... Who the hell? Oh, you're a dark brother, dude. Aspirin. Excuse me. Damn ferals. Radiation has a twist. Yeah, sure. Okay, let's head in here. Maybe we'll find some ammo for this thing. For the time, period, for the time being, we should probably switch to this. Uh, is Kate with me? Where the hell is Kate? I just wasted ammo on that thing. Oh, damn it. Uh, I'm sure Kate will come with me now. Ooh, activate. Come on, come on, give me that cake. Give us a cake. Come on. Ah, oh, son of a jackal. Uh. Oh wait, what? Uh, okay. There's nothing in here. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Lovely, jubbly. Okay, and, uh, let's, uh, wait, we're going this way, to good neighbor, hopefully Kate will catch up with us soon, maybe Cleo will have some fusion cells for this. Serenity Tower. Oh, bloody hell, that's a tower and a half. Eh. Uh, no, I can't be bothered going all the way up there. I'm lazy, what can I say? No. Where the hell is Kate? She's probably still in the bloody APC. For crying out loud. Bloody hell. So yeah, this is that common thing. Uh, actually, where the hell am I going? Am I following the right... 
here if I hadn't check that. Okay, I was going the wrong direction. Where's the uh map? Wait, do I have access to the video thing already? I do not. So still got a speak of the devil and he shall appear. Galaxy News Radio Friend of the show, Jerry is here. Is this thing on? Hello? Hello? It's on. Okay, Jerry. We're recording in here. Oh man. Shroud's dispatch justice already. Miss Selmy has been avenged. Okay, uh, shotgun time. Shroud off Wayne. Wait, so this guy's asking for me. You better believe it. So, Jerry, go on. Tell the listeners about what we're talking about. Right, so AJ, you know the chem dealer by Bobby's. He's doing good for himself. Says he's got a whole new market. Kids. Even with his garbage chems, he's just breaking in the caps. You hear that? Sounds like the Silver Hello, Shroud has another bad guy to deal with. Uh, why? This Shroud guy, he's gonna muscle in on the chem trade now? No. He's gonna do something about it. AJ's selling the kids. His chems have k killed people. And? <laughs> I'll get it. I can't let AJ kill kids. Whatever. Okay then. So. Oh. Galaxy News Radio. Okay, and so we've got to kill. Uh, AJ the chem dealer. Do I just have ammo for the silver submachine gun? I should do. Not sure if I have enough for AJ though. We went into good neighbor. Good neighbor, the best neighbor. Good, good, good neighbor. What a good neighbor. What a good neighbor. Here we go. Good old good neighbor, uh, Cleo. You I've have any weapon here for every situation? I'll take a look. Let's see what you have. Purchase a variety in case of boredom. Uh, let's see. Do you have? Oh God, yeah, I forgot. Uh, ammo. Uh, fusion cells. I should take all of them. And then ask for my inventory. Let's see. I should have. Uh, yeah, you can take that one because that's almost dead. You can take flamer fuels. You can take them. Uh, no, yeah, sure. You can just take these as well because why the hell not? Uh, do, I'm not going to give you that because I use that. 
how much would the Grognak costume go for? Only night? Nah, not much point telling you that. Uh, do, sure, you can take them. Pretty damaged, though, unfortunately. Uh, damn it! Anything else? Uh, you take the Rad X. Rad Scorpion Steak, I suppose. I never really use any of that. You're not taking my rum. You're not taking any alcohol. Elguai ribs. Oh, perfect. Uh, nope. Not quite perfect. Uh, that sounds better. Steak, I suppose. Oh, you can take the Psycho and attach the Jet. Sure, that'll do. Wait, where the hell is Kate? Better keep your iron strapped on. Friendly advice. I need but uh, you know, I, I I already know where Kate is. What the hell am I on? Oh, wait a minute, wait, wait, wait. Almost forgot. Almost forgot. Silver shield gear. There you go. Connected Look with at the clown. Friends. This is my turn, clown. Play. I'm just going to uh, very quickly uh, sure, I suppose, post my... I don't appreciate what you call them trespasses. Uh, peddling poison to kids, are we? Uh, no, nah, I'm not going to... Uh, I don't have to go. I know who you are. Peddling poison to kids, are we? Today, you face <laughs> the Silver Shroud. Uh, <laughs> who you say? Oh, for Christ's sake. Did Kent put you up to this? He keeps moaning about the poor little kids. What the hell, right? Tell you what. I'll pay you, let's say, 50 caps just to shut up about it. Really? And uh, maybe get Kent off my back, all right? That's it? Really? Stop no. selling to children, a miscreant, <laughs> or face my wrath. <laughs> I'm good at this. You. Waste the freak. Okay. Post my. Come on, boys. There we go. There you go. That worked a lot better than I thought it would, to be honest. <laughs> Uh, ooh, nice. Uh, leave that. Then, uh, sure, take the carrot as well, because why the hell not? The hell is this? Can't pick this. Nope. So that, okay then. The, did I? I'm just gonna, oh, oh. Everybody saw the silver sh Did they? I can't remember. Did everybody see the silver show go in there? Well, either way, I'm the one who's walking out. Uh. Hey, was that you stumbling out of the third rail last night? Is there actually anything? There's the Hotel Oxford. Is there anything else going on here? Ooh, stealing. Because Good Neighbor seems like the kind of place that would have something going on. Old State House. Let, let's just explore a little bit. Let's explore. You never know, eh? Hey, <sighs> boy. If you're sticking around, you'll need to join a crew. I hear Bobby No Nos is looking. Always a catch with the No Nos, but she pays. A new Bobby player no -no. and good neighbor. Hello, little pawn. Welcome to our fun and games. Uh, Fahrenheit? You ever tried chess? Right. Sometimes you need to sacrifice a piece to keep the game going. Keep that in mind. Ah, uh, neighbor. Uh. Right, so what the hell is this place? And who is Bobby Nono's? Let me just check that. Uh. Talk to Bobby. Where's. Okay, he's in. He's in good neighbor. Or is it a she? Because, because Bobby spelt with an I is usually 
the feminine spelling, isn't it? What's it? Okay, we've got a cell. I probably won't be making that my home. I've already got a home anyway. Uh, nothing in here. What about upstairs? Is there anything upstairs? If you're looking oh. to stock up on general equipment, you can hit Daisy's discounts. Keep a leash on your girlfriend. Looks like she bites. She's not here, and she's not my bloody girlfriend. Uh, oh! Wait a second. Is this Hancock's place? I think this might be Hancock's place. Uh... Yeah, because mind he was standing here and making that speech. Okay, and, uh... Wait a minute. What's... Okay. Sure, let's go ahead and talk to... Uh, you know what, first of all... Ah! Uh, where the hell is Kate? Okay, no, I'm, I'm gonna have to get Kate. Gotta get Kate, gotta get Kate. Okay, so we're back and we've got a certain fiery Irish woman with us. Finally. Uh, turned out that I just needed to fast travel and she didn't come back to me, so I just fast traveled to Good Neighbor. Didn't, didn't need to go far, but now. You looking for work? Uh, depends on the work. Depends on the work. You'll never find a more fair and honest job. If you don't mind a little manual labor and don't ask too many questions, you're in. I'll give you 50 caps to start. Interested? Uh, I'm going to need more to go on here. I'm going to need more to go on here. There's a project I'm working on. A big one. One that could get me into lots of trouble if the wrong person finds out. So little discretion is called for. I got a delicate house of cards going here. You know? Um, well, 50 caps, is you that it? That. Trust me, there will be much more later on. Just take the 50 caps. No, sure, why the hell not? Uh, I'm in. I'm in. That's what I like to hear. Let's go inside. Can uh, Kate admires me? Okay, and, uh, the big dig. Uh, right. <clears throat> Get to work. Uh. Just tell me what I need to actually... Yeah, what are you actually are doing? Are you going to tell me what we're actually doing? Look, we're pulling a job here. Big payoff. Taking some things that aren't technically ours yet. I'm going to need more information. If you expect me to work for you, I'm going to need more information than that. I'll tell you what you need to know when you need to know it. Right now, all you need to know is that I will give you an assignment... And you do it. You are going to be doing some digging. Uh. What? What? What are you? What are we digging for? Buried treasure. What are we digging for? Buried treasure. You could call it that, but seriously, lay off the questions. The other two are down there digging already. Go give them a hand, will you? Uh. Right, join the dig. You got a sec. Oh. Uh, what's up? Hey. Yeah, you have time to talk now. Still have something important to say. Uh. Go on. Go on. I'm not sure how to put this. We've been on the road together for a while. And we've taken some hard knocks. But no, through all that, that crap, I noticed you've always been sticking by me. You know. Watching me back and making sure I don't do anything stupid. I think maybe it's time to tell you a little bit about who you're traveling with. There's no reason for us to keep acting like we're strangers. Uh, I. Uh, it would be nice to know about, more about you. It would be nice to know more about you. You're saying that now, but when you hear me story, you might regret it. 
It all starts with two waves of humanity, I suppose you could call me parents. I'm convinced I was a mistake, because I can't remember a single moment that they treated me like their daughter. I was yelled at and beaten. Everything I did was wrong. Nothing but a nuisance in their eyes. The whole time I was telling myself that they had to love me, even if it was just the tiniest bit, because they never kicked me out. Then me 18th birthday arrived, and I found out why they kept me around. They slapped a shock collar around me neck and sold me to slavers. They didn't even care enough about me to say goodbye. Eighteen years of suffering through that shite, and all I was worth to them was a pocket full of caps. So, why didn't you run away? Why didn't you run away? I tried. Twice. The first time I did it, they locked me in a shed outside of the house we lived in. The second time, they broke one of me legs. Ooh. Life can be harsh, I suppose. Life can be harsh. You don't know the half of it. It would be easy to blame me German personality on me parents. But they didn't make me this way. I did. I was with those slavers for five years. Roughest five of me goddamn life. The things they made me do. The way they used me for their amusement. It sickens me to me stomach even thinking about it. But I bided me time and learned to use their own methods against them. Stealing a few caps out of a sleeping man's pocket is a piece of cake. As long as you don't get greedy. Uh, yeah, I, I would have killed them all, probably. I can't believe you tolerated that. I would have killed them all. That's easy for you to say. You weren't there. You have no idea what I went through. It took every ounce of patience I had. But after five years, I had finally pocketed enough to buy me own way out of there. But instead of heading off to try and repair the shambles of me life, I gave in to me rage and I headed home. You can imagine the look on me parents' faces when I kicked open their door. What you can't imagine is what they looked like after. After I emptied me gun into them. You did what you, yeah, you did what you had to do, I suppose, because they, they don't really sound like parents, to be honest. You did what you had to do. Did I? When I close me eyes, all I can see is their faces twisted with fear. And then my mind starts wandering and I start judging myself. And it's ripping me the fuck apart. You think I inject myself with all that shite and drink myself drunk because I'm a tough Irish girl. I do it so I can forget and move on with my miserable life. So there you are. The entire flawed package known as Kate. Stripped bare for your perusal. Um, yeah, it's okay, I'm, I'm lost faith in you. I mean, that just makes you a stronger Don't ass worry. or that I shit. I lost faith in you. I knew I was taking a chance telling you all this. I'm just glad I haven't disappointed you. Uh, it's, it's fine. fine. Good. I wouldn't want to strain our little partnership. Well, thanks for listening to me prattle. I suppose we can get back to business now. Yeah. Well, that was lovely. A little bit of a heartbreaking story, but oh well. Uh, what were we doing? Uh, yeah, right, yeah, dig, dig, dig. Digging. Uh, well, what are so you waiting for? Get digging. Yeah, yeah, uh, first fusion cells. I need fusion cells. I will take those, thank you very much. We'll take them as a bit of bonus payment. You're gonna drag that junk around. Yep. Uh, oh. Okay, this looks like the right direction. This looks like a dig. Here we go. Uh, hey, I think we can finally get through. Want to see what's on the other side? Oh, yeah. You think Bobby will pay us this week? I don't know, man. Starting to feel like a little charity. Just 
crawling with my alerts. Fail. Bobby can take this job and shove it. Good luck down. My alerts. Okay, uh um, Okay, our head is not very Should we just go for the legs? Wow. There we go and uh Exterminate the Marylurks. Okay, let me just Let's go for some Molotovs and There we go. I should get rid of some of them. Damn it, reload, reload! Okay, and uh, do that, and then should we go for the head again? There you go! One man, my luck! There you go! What the hell? Wait a minute. Put my luck egg, that could maybe be a little bit valuable, maybe. <laughs> But smash the other ones. Other ones don't want any uh, infestations going about, or another infestation, I suppose. What the? Where even are we, anyway? The sewers looks like. Uh, anything of interest? Glowing fungus, I suppose. What is going on in my tunnel? Ah, looks like we're having crab for dinner tonight. Uh, looks yeah. like we are having crab for dinner tonight. You'd eat my lurk? Ugh, no. Disgusting. <laughs> Tough, but somehow slimy at the same time. Yeah. Well, you stuck around at least. So I guess you're promoted. You get to be my new gun. I think we just need one more guy. An old friend. He'll want a fair cut, but we saw what being cheap got me. Uh, who is this who guy? Is this guy. He's just the guy we need to speed things along. Likes gadgets, money, and not much else. First, I think it's best if you actually see what we're after. I have some things to check on in Diamond City. Head okay. over to the noodle shop there, and I'll meet you when I finish up my business. Okay, so we're going to the noodle place. Lovely. Uh, okay, let's just carry on. So, should we carry on with this? I mean, we are running a little bit low on caps, and... Uh, Apparently, if this is a big payoff, it might be a risk we'll have to take. Because uh, caps aren't terribly easy to come by, I've found out. Uh, unless there's anything else worth looting here, is there? Uh, oh, we've got a or any lock for that matter. Hacking this is beyond me. No, nah, that is a terminal. Alright, uh, that's... Okay, nothing going on there. Should we take the coffee pot? Just in case we can improve our gear somewhat. Speaking of which, uh, I'm level 16. What level do I need to be to get the next gun nut? Gun nut uh... Uh, next rank level 25 for that uh, science level 17 I can get that for my next uh, upgrade and that's it although yeah of course there's armor on uh, that is tempting uh, you know, yeah we'll, we'll go for science because then that will let us upgrade our righteous authority Respect my authority! <laughs> uh, right. How many caps have we got, actually? 245. Uh, I think White Chapel hey there. Oh, Mate. And you're not even screaming yet. Very polite. You let me know if anything catches your fancy. Uh, sure. Let's see what you have. Everything's guaranteed to last. 
Until it doesn't. Uh, do you sell ammo at all? You do. You have fusion cells. Damn it. Uh, uh, sure, you can take some death claw sticks. Or you can take a good girl drag rad stag, myrock egg. Looks like it's not as expensive as I hoped it would be with my luck uh, eggs, but oh well. Uh, anything else I can give you? No, so I'll just accept that trade. So looks like we're heading back to Diamond City. Got a little bit of ammo for this. Right, back into the financial district. I should probably get a missile launcher. Uh, well, with the amount of times that missiles have killed me, it would actually be pretty useful. <laughs> yeah. hmm. Excuse me. A bloat? Where the hell did that bloat fly come from? Ah oh well, that don't matter. For now, we're heading back to Diamond City in the dead of night. Check the radio or the Trinity Tower radio signal. I mean, it could be interesting. Could have some of it. Nah. I should just remember that I don't have any stim packs. Whoa! Bloody hell, where the hell? Oh my. Okay, uh, you. I'm gonna go for a head for you. Head for you. Uh, okay, let's just uh, accept. There we go. Then we've got another one. No, we don't. We won't have another one. Good. Shotgun shells. Very nice. Stim pack. Very nice. Uh, do we? Bloody hell. Why the hell is my frame rate so terrible around about here? I set the graphics down to medium because apparently that's all my computer can handle. Even though it was working just fine last episode. Bloody hell, I need to see if there's a mod that will fix that. There probably is, to be honest. Because uh, uh, Fallout 4 is not very good with frame rates, I've noticed. Uh, especially um, the... Far Harbor DLC on PS4. It is terrible. I mean, like, I get like six frames per second on PS4. And the console editions are supposed to have superior frame rates. Because, of course, console is a lot better than PC. Ah, uh, bloody super means No. There we go. Go to you. Uh, where's ah, that? Oh, 
the hell is fist? Started cur curtain call. Investigate the video. Okay, sure, we'll try that. Uh, first of all, uh, investigate the radio broadcast. What radio broadcast? Uh, okay, so go up here. Whoa! Okay, uh, head. There we go. Okay, I no guarantee I'm gonna hit this, so I'm gonna make sure it's a guarantee that I hit it. Molotov, I will take that. Right, so we've got an elevator. Uh, let's go then. Let's head up. You all each other weakest of us. It only makes us stronger. I'm um, sure. Okay, so we've got some super mutants here then. There we go. Just have a Molotov in there and then... Okay, and, uh, good thing. I didn't fire when I told it to! Bloody hell, I cannot move my mouse too fast to shoot them because it will end up overshooting because of the stupid frame rate. This makes no sense. Bloody hell. Yes, I am annoyed. There we go. Oh, God, that. Okay, and, uh, I'm gonna go for your arms. I cannot go for your arms. Fine, I'll go for your head then. There we go. No, that's enhanced. That's actually pretty good. Fusion cells, nice. Not at all. Bloody hell, these guys are tough. I suppose they are super mutants. They're meant to be tough. Where the hell? There we go. Okay, uh... Where are guys up here? Oh, I just noticed my health. Bloody hell. Right then, um, Aiden, we're gonna go for. Uh. Go for that then. Nuka Cherry. And then we're gonna go up. Up, up, up. We go. Nobody stand still. Oh, hello there. He says before standing still. <laughs> Where the hell are we going anyway? Uh, ah, over here. Okay, uh, I'm gonna go for it. There we go, and then there we go. There we go then. Whew. Good thing about super mutants. They're big targets. Right, uh Here we go, I suppose. Unless there's anything worth looting, doesn't look like it. Maybe over here, no. Let me save it right here. <laughs> Come on then, Kate, let's go. Uh, Kate. Ah. There you are. I hear 
Bunch of super mutants up the stairs. Oh! Daddy, I'm shooting at you! Oh my god, I'm almost dead again! I prep bloody hell! I'll <sighs> just take a stim pack. Because to the rear. Ryan, I don't need to go down, I need to go up. Like really high up. Unless there's anything interesting. Stim two stim packs, nice. Super mutant leg armor. Why on earth would I have that? Okay, and, uh, up plenty of stairs right here. Okay, and uh we're gonna push this for the range. Uh, here we go. There we go. There you go. Whoa, who threw the Molotov? Who th who th who's throwing Molotovs? Bloody hell. You, you okay, uh, you head, head. Bloody. Oh, yeah. Okay, then. Bloody hell. Ooh. Let's have a... Uh, have some liquor cola. Man, bloody super mutant armor. Terracell key. We weapons work best. Let's. I don't think I'll be able to craft anything. Here. Oh, a large bayonet, though. Tempting, tempting. Uh, what about. Righteous authority? No, because I don't have. Science! Right, science ranks. Okay, and. Uh, Oh, magnificent part! A rescue! You were one of the first to actually make it to the cage. I think the super mutants killed and <clears throat> ate the others. Quickly get us out of here! More of my brothers down. will be here soon. I wish you'd make up your mind. They know a human is attacking the tower. Uh The Super Mutant 2? Super Mutant 2? Yes, him too. Oh, he's harmless. Well, Actually, he's far from harmless, but he won't hurt us. Trust me. Strong will not hurt human if human rescues strong and wrecks. See? Uh, why is the super mutant caged? Why is the super mutant caged? He defied his leader by standing up for me. See, I've given him a new purpose in life. I came here to teach these poor, ignorant creatures culture. I started with Macbeth. I guess ah. they found it funny. All of them except Strong here. Strong learned secret to human power from Mac Beth. Milk of human kindness. Strong will find milk. Strong will drink <laughs> milk. Strong will have secret power of oh, humans. No. Yes, yes, of course he will. When they grew tired of taunting me, they threw me in this cage. Little did they know. There was a radio in here. They know. You bait to catch more humans. What? Why didn't you tell me? Strong thought you know. See what I have to work with? I've promised Strong to help him find the milk of human kindness if we get out of here. Uh. Okay. I'll let you out. Hurry. Right. Uh. Follow Strong. 
He knows the best way down off of this cursed tower. Move it forward with the impact. Go with that. Go get my authority. Or my melee bubble head. Yeah, sure, we'll take that. Is it over here? Okay, shotgun again. Is that, that strong? Okay, uh, you, super mutant. Through your head. Bloody hell. Okay, and, uh, strong. Where are we going, strong? Uh, looted all that. Uh, where are we going? Down, down. Are we going down? No, we're not. We're going up. Actually, is there anything else worth? No, nothing else here. There's nothing else here. Oh, wait. Okay, uh, Kate. Kate. Ah, uh, she'll catch up with us. Right. I hear something. I shall. Well, wait a minute. Uh, let me just go ahead and just try and get him, get him on the way, dude. Ah, damn it. Oh well. Parting is such sweet sorrow. Our doubts are traitors. Oh, well, here's a new one. Okay. This Rex guy, I can see how he can get annoying from time to time. Ah, uh, right. I hear something. Yeah, super mutant, super mutant. There we go. Damn it, every time. Okay. I am nearly dead. So I'm going to critical this guy. Oh. Yeah, is it just me or are these super super mutants bigger than normal? Uh, actually, before we go strong, I'm just gonna uh, just step back. Right, uh, down we go, I suppose. Ah, hello there. Skirmishers as well, actually. But the, the boots are tougher. There you go. Killed one. That should have me a critical ready. Oh. We don't. On you go, Strong. Lead the charge. Or not. What's that? I'll tell you what it is. It's the sound of your. Where are we going? Okay, this way. Must have been nothing. Uh, it's not nothing. Go. Rex Goodman. Stupid noises. Okay, uh, okay, there's Kate. Okay, so. Uh, 
Is this is this where we're going? Yeah, talk to Rex Goodman. Okay. Okay, Rex. Rex. <clears throat> Many thanks for that timely rescue. No fight. To uh, what were you doing up there? What were you doing up there? I was attempting to teach those oh, civil yeah, and remember, human culture. Oh yeah, I remember. I'm stupid. Trying to civilize them. I thought if they could just experience the majesty of Shakespeare, it would change them forever. And who better to open their eyes to the wonders of the Bard than Rex Goodman, the foremost actor in the world today? Yes, well, <clears throat> I'd like you to have this. Now, uh, excuse, excuse me. me. I think it's time I left this awful place. I'm returning to WRVR and resuming my career in radio. Right. Uh, what did he give me? Reginald's suit. Uh, sorry, mate, but I'm not really the suit kind of guy. <laughs> if you couldn't tell already. But we can be a curtain call at least. Uh, have fun, Strong. Hopefully you find your milk of human kindness, whatever that means. Uh, right, anyway, um, onwards to Diamond City, I think. Yeah, uh, we'll do that later. Uh, the big dig. Yeah, meet Bobby in Diamond City. <sighs> my mom, baby, had a mom. I want her in my wigwam. She's just the way I want her to be. A million times hotter than TNT. Come, play on a fun. 